what's up guys, Gabriel Souza here. Today is Friday, one day before I compete at Worlds IBJJF. Uh, I just started off my day doing some hot yoga to loosen up the body and also relax for a little bit. Next is gonna be breakfast and then go to the beach, a long walk, maybe ride a bike, just to get my mind somewhere else besides the tournaments. And then after go home, watch some movies, just relax and get ready for watch more. Everything is pretty much ready. It's pasta, and ground beef, and then grape juice. I'm just pretty much gonna heat it up and put some uh, tomato sauce. And that's gonna be my lunch today. Um, since I don't need to cut weight, I'm really good on weight. I'm just gonna carb up, go to the beach, relax a little bit, come back, probably have some snack, and then dinner. I assume it's gonna be the same thing. Size. Otherwise, Natalia Shanter is gonna kill me. She's gonna take my life away. I've been with her since Brown Belt, I assume, like my worlds before my last worlds at Brown Belt 2017. We've been together, and she, she was always the one who took care of my diet. Every time she does something better, it's just crazy. Every single diet, like when she, whenever she prepared the next diet. It's even better, and even better, and even better. I think it also is like, since she, we, we've been working together for a while, she knows like how my body reacts for the type of food as well, so it thinks it, it's easier for, for her to get my diet plan. Also, everything depends the weight class I'm fighting. Right now I'm fighting for the weight, which that's the first time that I train on the weight, and then I can eat a lot a day before, the week off. But every time, just insane, every time she had more and more food for my diet and I love it. I mean, why not? I mean, eating great and training every day, that's amazing, best combination. As a blue and purple, I was at boost the weight. But my natural body weight was already 141, and the boost the weight cut was 127 with the gi. So I always cut weight because in my mind, I have to serve for that much to win. And but right now I understand that you don't. You do everything right. You you do a great diet. You do a great conditioning, strength conditioning training, and then you have a very you do it to speak for itself, right? You're very good. You really pay the price. It's gonna it's gonna happen. You don't need to cut 10 kilos, 20 pounds to to win something. And then back then I used to pretty much eat only chicken and lettuce. That's it. I don't know how I had any of those, to be honest. That was so crazy. But those days are over. Look, my pasta. Pasta and ground beef. Ooh. Biggest mistake that I did before was like, even when I was on weight, which was rare, I was always trying to eat outside. And then whenever you eat outside, that is a big risk, right? And also another thing, like people, Oh, it's one day before the tournament, I gotta eat healthy, I had to eat a lot of vegetables or letters the day before, that's also wrong. That's not a good thing to do, uh, because that's a lot, a lot of fiber. I think the day before, that's what we do, we, we prioritize the carbs, that's why I'm not adding no veggies, no letters, anything. Just carbs and some sort of protein, but I believe the gym is gonna be less protein, and they break fast also, so you see. This is a... Uh, the grape juice that I showed you guys that I was buying in the first video, right? So we can have some energy tomorrow and then win everything. Alright, let's get it done. We are at Santa Monica Pier, one of the most be beautiful beaches on the world and very famous as well. Uh, when I used to live in Cali, that was one of the best places I would come, like on weekends to hang out with friends, play some soccer, go for a swim, and also a good time to relax and recharge for next week. Right now is my resting day, right? I'm trying to just recharge as much as I can my energy, uh, avoid the tournament so I don't get drained from the from the very uh, loud crowd, right? So I can be more focused on different things and not focus 100% right now at the tournament. Later on, whenever I get home, I'm gonna start in picking up the mood, the war mood that I like to go in. Like, that's pretty much it. <laughs>
Let, let's see what they're doing here. Yeah, like the last couple of days I was there, I want to fight already. Since I've been resting well, eating well, so I just want to fight. But it's going gonna, it's gonna to happen at the right time. Just feeling good. Venice, it was a nice view. The day today is pretty nice, good weather. So I think we spent like 30 to 40 minutes. It was pretty nice. I like it. Uh, keep the body moving. It's pretty good. Stay tuned and watch me tomorrow on full grab. Yes.